At the tone, please record your message. Beep. Hey, listen, um, I just want my hoodie back. Can I please have my hoodie back? Before you left, I should have took it back, knowing you didn't have the integrity to put it back. And now here I stand with my looking ass, looking sad and looking bad, looking at the looking glass, look, knowing in your possession is something of mine you shouldn't have. You know what? You're like that gas that wouldn't pass. That dumbass question I shouldn't ask. That tattletelling girl next door I couldn't stand. And that dream job I couldn't land. You are the worst part of the worst day. You are every time I got bullied in the third grade. You are a constant reminder that I never should have went out with your goofy ass in the first place. You are the rain on everyone's parade. You are the gum that has lost its taste. You are that annoying ass person who just calls to say stupid shit and they can talk all day. You're rotten, like that back tooth. You're the equivalent of twerking without the ass to. You're that really bad food that refuses to just pass through. That's it, you're constipation. You're that brick of shit that gets more intense the harder it, the longer it sits, the harder it gets. You turn the stomach, your presence is pungent. You're the least favorite cousin at every family function. I hate you because I gave you all of me for nothing. In return, you stole my favorite hoodie knowing all this cold weather was coming. I get it now. You're that whack-ass snowstorm that forces kids to spend the entire day inside. You're like gentrification when it ruins a community's entire way of life. You're an entree of red flags on an entire plate of lies. Your little mama, when she interrupted Alicia Keys and Jay-Z's empire state of mind, and I just want my hoodie back. Can I please have my hoodie back? You're reminiscent of the time when in seventh grade, Tamika Gordon caught me staring at her beautiful face and her only response was, ugh, what the fuck are you looking at? <laughs> Neck snap and all. It hurt, but I got through. You are a bless you less hot shoe. That hoodie was warm and comfortable, and unlike you, it cost a lot too. Translation, you add and have no value. After dealing with you, I need a volume. When you would talk, I turned up the volume, hoping in a sea of music and TV, I could drown you. And I ain't even trying to clown you, because for real, yo, what do clowns do? In most cases, they make children happy. In your case, children don't want to be anywhere around you. But in good spirits, I hope this message has found you. And I hope the beauties of sun sunshine surround you. Please know that I am a poet, in case you didn't know it. And if I don't get my hoodie back, I'm going to continue to write petty shit about you.